I'm going to give you some information about the course 6083 that we offer in the freight department. Um, this is an introductory course that students typically take um, during their first semester of their study here. We brush over a large number of quantitative methods um, and I teach the mathematical techniques that you need for these methods and also how to model and um, how to compute the solution. We compute the solution either in closed form explicitly or we, we use numerical techniques. Uh, so um, the prerequisite uh, for this course are linear algebra, calculus, probability theory, statistics, at least basic statistics. And if you are a bit weak in, in one of these areas, we, I suggest that you take the refresher courses that we offer in the department. To be more specific, uh, during the first half of the semester, uh, we cover static models, such as the Markowitz portfolio theory or um, risk measures. Then during the second half of the semester, we uh, look at dynamic models. That is, we model systems that evolve in time and um, the, some models that we, we study are the binomial tree model or the Black and Scholes uh, option pricing theory. Uh, more precisely, uh, we cover um, at the beginning uh, of, the, of the semester probabilities for several variables, conditional probabilities, conditional expectations, we define some risk measures such as VAR or the expected shortfall. We study the dependent structure uh, between uh, several random variables. We, um, I introduce copula functions. We, we also look at some statistical um, methods such as the principal component analysis or um, linear uh, regression, nonlinear regression, prediction the connection between linear regression and the maximum likelihood method. Um, then I also teach um, some basic concepts of, uh, of stochastic processes, uh, such as Martin Gales, uh, Markovian processes, Gaussian processes. Uh, we spend a couple of classes on the Markov chains that are really the underpinning for, for, for the credit risk modeling. And, and that's about it. I mentioned before um, the Black and Scholes theory and, and the binomial tree model that we will see at the very end of, of the course. I will give uh, some weekly assignments that will be graded, they are mandatory. I also assess the progress of the students through um, a midterm examination and the final examination. Um, in the midterm examination, I typically assess the raw quantitative skills, whereas um, in the Final examination, we focus more on the applications. In, uh, uh, in the assignments, I will ask you to write some simple codes. Uh, you can pick any language you want, but I recommend MATLAB, especially for the students who don't have any prior experience in, in programming. This will um, help you gain a, a deeper understanding of the methods that we see in class. And, and that will give you an opportunity to, to test them. And, and that's uh, all you need to know. All right.